Hey guys, welcome back to the video. Um, I'm back. I'm posting again consistently this time. Saturday, y'all got a video. As I always say, I upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Do I say that? I upload every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and, and Sunday. So, the video Monday. So, I actually appreciate that. Today, I'm watching uh, CG the Champ. The video will be down in the link below. And always, it's fine if you guys subscribe. If not, keep going. Um, to subscribe is free, and you can unsubscribe later. So, let's get on with the video. And Lomos, our featured guest today. Nice cool pirate yeah. question mark man. So let's watch. So then they all just start boxing. A whole ass turf war. Damn. Damn. Takes me back. <laughs> nah. You were right. You you were like, he's gonna get beat up. I was like, who? This guy. Yeah. yeah. Right. He's getting smashed. We got this dude smiling while beating Damn. his ass. Then this man jumps off a car on some WWE types and just <laughs> Jeff Hardy. Basically. <laughs> CJ the champ. I like that. Double fire. Alright, y'all, so as we know, there's been some pretty good. <laughs> Caillou? <laughs> Basically. <laughs> has to be Tokyo Revenge. Now, some of y'all are probably like, CJ, why is this your favorite anime right now? Well, why? Tokyo Revengers is Black Air Force Energy, the anime. Like, dog, Damn. bro, this shit is a wild. Like, dog, Fight niggas that. getting drunk. Fight niggas that. getting Fight beat that. the Fight up that. from left to right. They are having... Yeah, but would you survive in this universe, though? It's the thing. Would you be able to survive in this universe? Would you be able to beat them up yourself, Momo? Or would you be the one getting beat up? Yes. Like, yes, I would. You, you'd get beat up? Maybe. But I'm probably... I'm most likely going to kill them. I don't know, man. We'll, we'll see. Yeah. We'll, we'll see. Anything... Anime is possible. I guess. In middle school, and then I'm just sitting there watching it like, damn. Like this anime has gone to the point where I'm going to have to literally analyze and give this a entire Black Air Force energy synopsis video. Basically, you, once the new round table is constructed, quite a bit of these dudes are probably going to be sitting on there, along with this guy, because this guy's video is taking it's, so goddamn long because there's too much shit I gotta put in it. Damn it! <clears throat> but anyways, it's him. Like He's a legend. This show of Black Air Force <laughs> synopsis. So I have compiled everything from episode one through fifteen in one entire exhibit, and then when the anime fully finishes, I'm gonna have another one. So damn, I guess this is gonna be a. T I'm still waiting, CJ. Oh, shit. We're, we're still waiting. We're still waiting for that thing. Um, waiting. But anyway, as y'all already know, we got the evidence on deck. And it is time to dive into this A1 Savagery. Hey, but let me go ahead and give that spoiler one real quick. If you have not seen episodes one, I haven't watched it, but I've yeah, already guys. watched this anime. It's actually good. Watch it, then come back. <clears throat> Exhibit A. Alright, so we're introduced to our main character, Takemichi. And goddamn. Is he good? He don't get off his ass and clean oh, shit. his nasty ass apartment, bruh. Like, bro, you know it smell musty as hell in that hole. This man got some dirty ass dishes that he probably ain't even washed since he moved in. Man, got He's a dude, man. He's on the floor, probably making it smell like foot fungus in that bitch. Like, get your lazy <laughs> ass up and go to the dumpster, nigga. Nasty ass got beer cans and Playboy magazines all over the damn place. And, oh, oh, hey, he, he's a. Is that. You, He's nasty. He, he's yep. eating his. He's yeah. eating his meat. Mm -hmm. Yep. Nasty ass nigga. Gay. Please tell me. Should have taken that shit in the restroom, bro. Have you just finished beating your shit? Oh my God, get your lazy ass up and put it in the trash. So why this man? Exactly. He beat his meat. With his greasy ass yes. fingers. He's watching the news and he realizes that his ex girlfriend just died. Oh, and guess who's the killer? Damn. Damn. You're saying he's beating so his meat with a, to a dead girl? <laughs> Oh wow! Down bad, bro. I mean, we've seen his room. His ex-girl just died. He's working at the local blockbuster and shit. So how could his <laughs> blockbuster? Uh, That's tough. Well, get pushed out into the train tracks. Huh? Excuse me. Say that again. Train tracks. Yeah. So Did Bo Did Bo die or something? Twelve years into the past, back to his middle school days as a whole ass delinquent. So these dudes out here looking for a fight with some second years, but they did not understand the fate that they was about to catch. Cause they it's like that. To these niggas, bro, smoking yeah. cigarettes and shit, looking like they got them thirty years. Bro, what grade are these guys in? Aren't they like what high school? Yeah, seems so. <laughs> no, Japanese. This is Japanese. This anime is just different. The fact that these guys are like seventeen, eighteen. They they like delinquents. They like they're thirty. 21. Look at, Look at them. Shoes. 
Air Force is the <laughs> black ones. The black ones. <laughs> the black ones. Oh. Damn. Damn. My bad? What up? Did, did my audio cut out or am I tripping? Oh, his audio cut out. Move yet, there you go. Look at these tears of joy. Like, this man is in pure relief right now because my guy's like, oh, thank God. Oh, He's like, she didn't die. Struck yet. So he figures out that the little brother's handshake is a link so he can jump around time and shit. So these two are like, all right, bet. Let's work together to save Hina's life from Truck Coon's almighty wrath. Hey, oh, yeah, Truck Coon. It's a truck. It's a W truck. It's that truck everybody knows. So because my nigga gonna go through some goddamn tribulation. This man goes back into the past and spawns into a whole ass pit fight just to get knocked the fuck out. And That's then after that, since he lost the fight, bro, he got jumped by the dudes that had a bet on him. Then this nigga with the black forces started beating his ass with a bat. Like he was beating his ass from the black elevens. Like it can't be. <laughs> man was just laid out in pack. Like look at his leg, bro. The nigga can't even Damn. walk. So after my guy gets a whole ass morale boost from Truck Coon's next meal, he's like, I right, bet time to stop being a bitch. I'm about to <laughs> fight the nigga that beat my ass with a bat. It, it didn't go so well. Of course it didn't. Look at that. that. Nigga with a cigarette in his mouth. been watching too much One Piece for a long time. One Piece. Like, right, Sanji. Out, so he pulls out a whole ass oh. knife and is about to shank this nigga. But when everything looked like it was going down, oh, man. lo and behold, Jojo. Two Black Air Force guys have a... These guys are the best. I'm just going to say, like, I haven't watched it, but these guys right here, right. goaded. Draken and Mikey. First off, first off, let's just look at the appearances real quick. This nigga got a whole ass tattoo on his head in middle school. You could just tell by his... Excuse me? Say, say that again? Yeah, in middle school. That's crazy. Yeah. He pulls up like a whole last menace. Hands in his pockets and shit, <laughs> not giving a fuck, bro, bro, bro. You know this nigga got hands for days. And then... Of course you do. Now, when you first see Mikey, you're like... Who is this goofy ass little nigga? Like I thought he was Draken's little brother or some shit. Then everybody starts bowing and then you're like, wait, 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 wait a minute. Some ain't right here. Then it shows that he's a whole ass commander, bruh. Like this man radiates so much black air force energy when he walks, he got everybody bowing and shit. And then just look at the look. Doesn't like, man is like, doesn't like BM? That nigga. Like just straight up embarrasses this man in front of That's everybody, tough. and then to yep. add more salt on the room, this man Mikey literally pulls up on him with a smile on his face. Then... Why is he doing this? Is like the audio going? I have no idea. Time okay. to go. Oh, there it is. Oh my god. Yo, this man is a whole ass savage dog. He walks up into a whole ass fight club, makes everybody bow down to him, then beats the shit out of this nigga, then leaves. <laughs> My God. <dog. laughs> so then after that whole debacle goes down, they all become pretty good friends. So then right. he gets invited to a whole ass gang meeting. And then he okay. gets in the back by this ugly ass granddaddy long legs looking ass boy right here. <laughs> that look boy. His head, bro. This nigga he look weird, bro. Fuck. Like, dog, yep. it is sideways. How can you turn your head a like spider. that? You fucking marionette. So they're having this game. <laughs> they're about to have a whole ass gang war against this game called Mobius because uh, they, they did some shit. Some heinous ass shit. Like, they beat the brakes off of this dude's friend. Redude of the healer, his girl, right in front of him. Then they robbed uh -huh. the nigga, then beat up his parents and his siblings later. Like, look at Damn. her, bro. No, no, nigga. You got a box after that, my G. Like, you gotta run the got after that, bro. If not, you just, you just a baby. Story, no jutsu. This man got the whole ass tattoo on his head in the fifth grade, bro. Out here beating the shit out of niggas. So this whole ass middle school is smoking a cigarette. He like, hey, yo, nigga, I need you to find this dude named Mikey. So when Draken first meets Mikey, he's like, who is this little snot-nosed bastard? I was expecting a whole ass middle school giga nigga or some shit. No, no, this man Mikey didn't waste no time with this sorry ass nigga. He straight up flew at his ass and dropped it the fuck out, bro. Lay his ass out and smoked his pack. And he did this in elementary school. Man, Excuse these me? Kids these days out here getting these black Damn. early as hell. So then we go back to the conflict that Takemichi's trying elementary. to stop. Elementary. He doesn't stop this yep. or Dragon's gonna get got. So he's like, hey, y'all, we don't need to fight these niggas. But of course they didn't listen. This nigga Paul started beating the shit out of him. Not gonna cap, though. Paul Loki is a real nigga. I mean, he's trying to stand he up is. for his homie and his homie's girl that got hey, beat the fuck up. It's whatever. Oh, bro, I'm sorry. This nigga ugly. Yep. <laughs> Paul seems like he's that one dude in the group. Like, he's like the most realest and chillest nigga in the group. But he the ugly nigga that don't. No hoes, bro. That's but what I'm he saying. Though, so he can no hoes, but hey, he's the realest one in the group. That's what I'm saying. Got my respect. But then Mobius pulls up to the whole ass spot ready for the smoke. Though. Damn. They brought all the ops and every shoot on the block. So then Pasta. Yeah. 
<laughs> Shoot up on the block. Look at these clean ass jabs, dog. Snapped his whole head back. Dog, look at his face. Man, it's. You wanna ever be with a. Is Brooke on? Oh, he's back. He's back. It's already out on his feet. Damn. Damn. Nigga Mikey's like, sit back and watch, guys. Mikey, Mikey, everybody ain't you, bro. Get this nigga out of here. Like, I understand having heart and everything, but come on, throw him the goddamn towel. Dude ain't even got on shoes no more. And then the Damn. dude finally passed out. I was like, thank God, bro. I couldn't watch that shit no more. So then Mikey Damn. said, you did well, my guy. Thank you for opening for the main event. And look at all these stupid Red ass wine. talking all this shit. Like, they some dumbasses. Like, if I see a dude walking like this, bro, some ain't right. This man is just casually walking up to him with his hands in his pockets. Ain't even he, he, looking he at him. He know what he's doing. One shot, the bro. He hit this nigga with the nastiest roundhouse kick I have ever seen. And just he like threw his face into the ground. Bro, we need like a name for this kick or something. We need to call this like the that's monkey crazy. roundhouse or some shit. Cause yo, that's just nasty. Then all the shit talking grunts are like, oh, what the fuck, bro? What, what, what just happened? Your exactly. Dropped in under 10 seconds by a Damn, nigga in flip flops. Yo, that's just embarrassing. So then this guy just loses and <laughs> tries to shake Mikey. But this man Dracus said, cut that shit out, my boy. So then the cops are coming in. Everybody's trying to dip. So to add more salt to the wound for this nigga, Pa comes out of nowhere and oh. shakes his ass. And was like, I ain't letting you get away with that shit, bitch. But it was kind of stupid. Because I gotta go. Pa had to stay and get away. Damn. I mean, it Damn, that's tough. Though, so shit, uh, shit, nigga, that was worth it. It was. It was. He liked that. Hey. <laughs> he, he got out, though. Take the shit out of that dude. You think oh, you really? Did, little bitch boy? <laughs> they stabbed him. Y'all remember the guy that, that got like, crazy. the shit kicked out of him? Yeah, yeah. This guy's back because he wants to kill Draken for embarrassing back. his sorry ass. So they find Takamichi out here being nosy and shit, so they beat his ass up. All right, bitch, yeah. Just leaves him there. So Draken ends up getting sneaked because this nigga is a stank-ass rat. This granddad basically legs ugly-ass boy. Homie trying to get revenge because Pa went to jail. Nigga, why you mad at him? Pa could have left if he want to. He could have. Rat ass. Snitch ass bitch. Ratted out your whole crew to a whole ass another game. For real. Then Mikey pulls up and he's like, hey bro, what the fuck is going on? Little rat ass bitch, this ain't how we do shit. And then this exactly. old lanky oh. ass boy comes out of nowhere. And he blocks the Mikey 3000 roundhouse. So obviously, you know, he gotta be the leader. So this man brought a hundred to jump the shit out of four niggas. But nah, we don't do no jumping here, boy. Cause the whole squad pull up on some whole ass gang activity. <laughs> you see this way you gotta, you gotta have friends like this, so I'm saying like come on now. So then they all just start boxing. A whole ass turf war. Oh my god, but he broke his neck! That nigga is dead! Then we got this dude smiling while beating this nigga's ass. Then this man jumps off a car on some WWE type shit and just gets a whole ass <laughs> double kill. So then Mikey's like, Damn. get your little rat ass out here, boy. This man is really holding a whole ass conversation while whooping niggas asses in front of him. And yo, this man is so lucky Mikey is in the Damn. country. treats his man like family. Because Whoa. anybody else, this nigga would have got smoked for ratting out his whole crew. So then talking me to <laughs> Nah, he would have. He would have killed him. Like, yep. straight up. He's old dude and he's like, he wait a dead. damn minute. He got blood on his knife. Oh shit, my nigga got got. Uh. But this dude is such an absolute unit. He is still alive. But here come Kiyomasa's bitch ass with his whole little nasty ass click. Some rat ass niggas themselves. So obviously Draken can't fight at the moment. So my guy Takemichi's like, alright bro. I got, I got this. Balls. My girl's watching. My homeboy's watching. The girl I tried to fuck in the karaoke booth is watching. I cannot afford to be a bitch right now. And look at her believing in her man and shit. Nigga, she a keeper, bruh. Takemichi, you better not fuck anything up, bruh. So you wanna even fight this little bitch ass nigga? Stabs him in the fucking hand, bruh. But my Damn. guy rips that shit out of his hand and starts biting him. Cause, cause he's like, like that, bruh. Trying to eat his ass like a whole ass ghoul. And then he gets his back. Ghoul. Gets his ass <laughs> in a whole ass rear naked chest. Let's go. And chokes the life out of that. Nigga. He's like that. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious, Joe Rogan would be going crazy over this shit. Choked his ass out and smoked his pack. Takemichi went from bitch nigga to real nigga real quick. So these old punk asses gonna try to jump through. Then we're just to rags. The, the ride or dies pulled up, bruh. This just shows that everybody need a ride or die. <laughs> look at that dude. His arm. <laughs> Toretto will be so proud right now. Like, look at him, bruh. He pulled up in the Bruce Lee stance and the other ones in the whole ass flying crane. Hey, yo.
I mean, even though they getting their ass beat, they some real ass niggas. They, got I mean, they held them on till they yeah. had to retreat, so that's a dub. I mean, they had to take this man Drak into the hospital, but I ain't worried though. He a real nigga though. He gonna survive. Shit, it's just a stab. Of course he move. is. This little rat yep. like a pay on at the goddamn hospital. Ooh, you so lucky Dom Toretto got a big influence on Mikey's life. Because if that was me, and you almost got one of my homies killed. Nah, it would've been over. Smoking your little rat ass. Get the fuck out of here, bro. So Takemichi finally finished his mission. So he's like, I bet I can finally go back to the future and everything's gonna be fine. I mean, he's still working at the dusty ass blockbuster and shit, but everybody's alive though, so that's a dub. Man got to talk to Hina again. I don't know why the fuck they broke up. My nigga, she's a keeper, but I mean, you do you, she. Bro, I don't then, Jesus Christ. So he goes to the bathroom and tells Hina to go to the car. Then when he comes out the bathroom, <laughs> You remember the tall she got smoked, ass man. nigga that blocked the Mikey 3000 roundhouse? This nigga says, you're not in the car. Oh, that sucks. I was hoping I could take care of you both at once. Damn. Hell no, nah, bro. Something nah, bad happened. No, nah, we ain't doing this shit. So he is just chilling in the smart car, right? And lo and behold, look who's behind us. But again? Damn. There's no way, bruh. Somebody trying to stop my divine wrath. <laughs> hilarious, hilarious, I tell you. Good show, good show. <laughs> what a surprise, Fist. You didn't think Big Daddy Chuck Hoon would come and find you because your little boyfriend went back in time to save your little sorry ass. You may stop me. <laughs> bruh. I'm gonna be honest, if that would happen again, I would just go back. Okay. I'm, I'm done for now. Nah. <laughs> Chad, dude, dude, it's aggressive. Damn, and she dead just like that. Oh no, Tracoon strikes again. Damn. My ride or die, nigga. Oh my god. And bro, he literally had to watch her suffer in that car and get blown the fuck up. Oh my Jesus Christ. Oh, Chuckoon, you evil son of a bitch. So Takamichi and Naoto are like, ah, shit, bro. We got to start again from square one. We got to make sure none of Truck Coon's vessels are summoned to this domain. So they do some research, and we figure out that our boy Dragon is on death row for catching multiple bodies. And we figure out the dude that's doing all this bullshit is this ugly-ass bastard right here. So oh, no one likes bro. We got to have to go back in time and murk this nigga to make sure his ass ain't breathing in the future. Because if this nigga ain't breathing, she's breathing. And we want her to breathe. So our boy Takamichi she goes back into the right. past to stop Kisaki. Oh, and what do you know? This ugly bastard got promoted to the third division captain. So our boy Takemichi's like, ah, oh, fuck all that bullshit, nigga, and just rushes his ass. Sock the shit out of this ugly ass boy. And then this dude, Baji, remember the WWE ass nigga that jumped off yeah. the car? Yeah, but he starts coming yep. in and welling on our nigga Takemichi, bro. Like, damn, why? Dude, why you had to do my homie like that? Then this little punk ass bitch punches our boy Takemichi in the face. Oh, I hate this nigga. Then this man no. wakes up. Wow. <laughs> You awake, my nigga. <laughs> this man Bruh. like, damn, cuz you got knocked the fuck out to that Steve Urkel looking nigga. So Mikey sends Takemichi on a Steve Urkel? <laughs> infiltrate this new game called Valhalla, the one that the WWE superstar left for. So then this dude, Kasutoro, comes up and picks up Takemichi. He's like, hey, bro, I'm gonna take you back to our base. So when he gets to the base, he sees Baji beating the shit out of this nigga. Like, straight up pummeling his face. And that's his whole ass vice captain. Oh, and guess what? Look, the tall ass niggas there, too. I you bet. already know this little rat ass nigga probably got some shit to do with it then they're like we're gonna kill mikey Pfft, i don't know about that one they can't uh, uh, you could try who is you so yeah i guess that's really it for exhibit a i mean this is the longest shit i've ever done because i kind of did kind of go through like 15 episodes but hey i mean it is what it is bro but like i said bro tokyo revengers is the shit bro this is black air force energy the anime and a when the anime is over and we finally get the rest of the episodes we can do exhibit b and put some niggas on this table but anyways uh, uh y'all take it easy and i'm gonna go ahead skedaddle black air force up in the all right so what you think what you, what you think about this this is fucking crazy. <laughs> Truckin is a menace. He, I think he's always been a menace. He's just been chilling in the background. He's like, yeah. Oh. He's like, hey, anyways, little one. I he's catch like, a sorry ass whacking. <laughs> nah, it's, it really was like that. He's like, oh, she's still alive? Tough. <laughs> <laughs> she's not going to be breathing What's in a bit. Red face? <laughs> <laughs> that is crazy. Yep. Nah, but, um, Guys, this is another successful video that we just recorded. 
this wasn't in our plan, I'm gonna be honest. But Momo, he was he was the go and he wanted to record. Sure. So yeah, um, hope you guys enjoy these videos. I'm just cooking up, just just making them. Just keep keep on going. Just it's a lot better. Cause um you know, new videos means new content for you guys and uh. Oh shit! It got silent. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I almost You're good. my Discord. You good, man? We had new new content. You know, means new new things for the channel. So um, hope you guys are enjoying the content. And as always, I'm your host the most, joined by Momo. He'll probably be joining in a while. But um, I'll, I'll record his goodbye. Oh, there he is. Momo, anything to say to the to the people? I gotta take some while to, but anything to say? You said what? What? what, what what's happening? <laughs> any, 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 anything to say to the people? What's, what do you mean, six people? And yes, I said, do you have anything to say to the people? Like, oh, well, yeah. As always, don't forget to <laughs> drop a like in this video, subscribe to this video. I'm mean, not video, subscribe to PJ's channel and mine as well. Turn on post um, notifications in case a new video comes out. In case a new video drops. Whenever, whenever it comes out, honestly, because I just... Yeah. I'm consistent, but I just... I upload sometimes. But, yeah, guys. Thank you, Momo, for letting us out. And, you guys, thank you for watching. See you guys in the next one. Bye.